Hello everyone and welcome to today's video on the Iraqi Dinar News Channel. Today is June 5, 2024, and we're diving into a trending and highly researched topic, the impact of electronic payments on the Iraqi Dinar. Recently, there's been significant buzz around the Iraqi government's efforts to increase the use of electronic payments. This initiative is seen as a key strategy in managing the economy and addressing long-standing issues such as inflation, corruption, and a lack of financial transparency. A recent article highlighted a statement from a government source, emphasizing that the electronic payment process will aid the government in withdrawing excess cash from public circulation. This move indicates the Iraqi government's active approach to reducing physical cash usage, which has been a major contributor to economic problems like inflation and corruption. The large amount of physical cash in Iraq has posed numerous challenges. With so much cash in circulation, it becomes difficult to control the money supply, leading to inflationary pressures. Additionally, Cash transactions are harder to track, increasing the risk of corruption and reducing transparency in the financial system. By shifting to electronic payments, the government aims to better regulate the money supply, thereby reducing inflation and stabilizing the dinar. According to the article, the Iraqi government has been working on this transition for quite some time, investing heavily in the necessary infrastructure and technology. The significant investment, reportedly amounting to 1.6 trillion dinars, underscores the government's commitment to modernizing the financial system. The shift towards electronic payments offers several benefits. Firstly, it can help to stabilize the dinar by allowing the government to control the money supply more effectively. With less physical cash in circulation, the risks of inflation and financial instability can be mitigated. Secondly, electronic payments increase transparency. Every transaction leaves a digital trace, making it easier to track financial activities and reducing opportunities for illegal or unethical practices. However, the transition is not without its challenges. The government needs to ensure that the necessary infrastructure is in place. This includes making sure that electronic payment systems are reliable, secure, and accessible to all segments of the population. Additionally, public acceptance of electronic payments is crucial. There may be concerns about privacy and security, which the government will need to address to build public trust in the new system. Despite these challenges, the potential benefits of moving towards a more digital economy are significant. By reducing physical cash, the government can better manage the economy, fight corruption, and enhance financial transparency. This shift could lead to a more stable and prosperous economic environment for Iraq. As we continue to follow this story, it will be important to monitor how these developments impact the Iraqi dinar and the broader economy. The government's success in implementing electronic payments could set a precedent for other nations facing similar challenges. Thank you for tuning in to today's video. We hope this update has provided valuable insights into the impact of electronic payments on the Iraqi dinar. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to share them below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more updates on this and other important topics. Bye for now.